Good morning, friends. Welcome back to another video. Today, I am flying home to see my family. I have not seen my family since April. It was before I started my YouTube content quality analyst job, so I am ready to see them. I'm feeling a little groggy though, because it's, I don't know, like six something in the morning. I'm gonna show you how dark it is outside. It looks a little bit darker from <laughs> my perspective, but it is very, very early in LA. Nobody is awake, nobody. I'm just waiting for my friend to pick me up and then I'm gonna head to the airport. My flight takes off at 9.37. I fly to Charlotte, North Carolina, and then I have a layover for like an hour. And then I fly from Charlotte to Myrtle Beach. That's where my family's gonna be for a week. I'll be vlogging at the beach. You know what's up. But I'm just so excited to see my mom and my dad and my sister and my niece. She's so cute, but she's getting so big. I mean, I know that's what happens. Like they grow up, but it's very, shocking it's like i didn't know i mean i knew anyway um i'm just ready to see them and i'm gonna be showing you guys what it's like at the airport you know i mean i've flown a couple of times during the pandemic and i've tried to be honest with you guys and show you everything so i'm gonna try and do the same you know i think <laughs> when your parents are nervous about flying that rubs off onto you so you're always nervous about flying like do i have everything do i have my passport do i have this do i have my vaccination card like just trip in to make sure that i have everything and i know that i have everything but i just need to get there and get checked in so i can chill out also i'm checking a bag so i'm trying to get there a little bit earlier too so that i can and like get that all done anyways if you guys are ready to fly with me give this video a big thumbs up hit the subscribe button and hit the bell to get notified anytime i post and let's go to the airport so i'm at the airport i definitely was almost late i thought that because it was saturday it would not be as much of i be, i thought because it was saturday it wouldn't be as much traffic was i wrong it's a lot of traffic and I had to wait in line to check my bag. I'm now in line for TSA. I have to get checked through security. But uh, I'll let you know when it all works out because I'm a little stressed. Okay, so I've made it through security. I am now in line to get breakfast. Um, I'll talk more once I get breakfast, hopefully. This has been the craziest airport experience. I mean, I knew LAS was bad, but like, this is <laughs> crazy. All right, y'all, I am waiting on my Dunkin' Donuts, which I waited in this long, stupid long line. All I wanted was pumpkin or caramel. They were sold out of both. So I got mocha, hopefully I like it. Um, let me tell you about my airport experience. So coming here, it's a Saturday morning. There was stupid traffic. Um, I've never experienced that in the morning, at night, yeah, but uh, crazy traffic. Two, as I was checking my bag, there was this kid throwing the biggest fit. I don't think I like kids, but whatever. I like babies, but I don't like kids because kids can like articulate what's wrong, but he was just throwing a fit, just to throw a fit. And then when I got through security, there was this couple that was touching each other. And I was like, it is eight in the morning. Do we really need to like make out right now anyway? I waited in line, like I said, for coffee. Stupid long line. Who am I? I'm 69.20, so I'm next. Um, all I wanted was caramel or pumpkin. Sold out of both, so I got mocha. I think mocha's ch like chocolate, so. And then I'm gonna go to my gate and fill up my water bottle and get on this plane to go home. I like traveling. I do like traveling, but uh, this is crazy. Hey guys, so I made it to my beach house and let me tell you that airport experience was absolutely insane. It was crazy. So many people, people like just going insane. Anyway, now that I've traveled, let me give you a tour of my beach house. I know this video was about traveling, but you know, I made it here. So let me show you around. So as you walk in the front door, it's the living room area. That's on the floor for my niece. My cute mama's over there. On our left is my bedroom. Look at it. Look at how nice it is. I cannot wait to sleep after a full day of traveling in the room. There's also a TV. I can hook up my Netflix and all that stuff. And then there is a bathroom. My mom already gave me sunscreen and toothpaste. 
Yeah, I've been driving all day. I look wild. Da -da -da -da. Over here is another bedroom. This will probably be my sister and her husband's room. Decor. And it connects to that other bedroom. And my niece is asleep in there, so I'm not going to go near it. Because I don't want to wake her up. Living room some more. Here's the table. It's got like a picnic bench kind of vibe. This will be my parents' room. Cutesy cute. She's giving very beach. And they have their own bathroom. Not connected to mine. Look. It's giving very master bedroom. And continuing on. The table and then the kitchen area. I believe in here is the washer and dryer. Yes, I am correct. More things. And then we have a full kitchen. It's super lovely. But let me show you the best part. And it's right downstairs, outside. There's a little patio area you can kind of see. I don't want to turn on the light because I don't know how. <laughs> and then right down yonder is our pool. There were lights that were just on, but they just turned off. We're still learning how to work everything. But I tell you what, we've got some partying neighbors. Yeah, I'm with you, sis. There's also like a screen here. So, okay, I'm gonna go back inside. And that concludes my little beach house tour. I'm tired, I've been up since 6 a.m. I'm just gonna eat something for dinner and I'm gonna head off to sleep. So if you guys like this video, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up, hit the subscribe button, and hit the bell to get notified anytime I post, and I'll see you guys here next time. As always, keep it positive.